Hello friends, in this video we are going to discuss about ChatGPT. It's a new robot, we can say. Some people say that it will replace the Google. And let's see the magic of ChatGPT. Without further delay, let's get started. So here I will go to your Google Chrome and type. You can use any browser. Type ChatGPT. And here you will see this is from OpenAI. This is the official website. And you can go here and try Chat. GPT so chat GPT optimizing language models for dialogues if you see here here are some samples available for us so I will go to try chat GPT and here you will see one editor you can pass your message and chat GPT will reply so you can type anything here in terms of programming I will type write a program factorial in Java so you can type anything just randomly I am typing any questions so here is the Java program to calculate factorial of a given number so I provided half information but based on its machine learning model it is getting actual and this is the actual example of it you can copy this code and use in your id as well so i have this demo application here i will copy that code and here directly i can paste that it will create factorial class for us here if you see all the code it's around 21 line of code it is written by a robot run this application so here it is asking enter a positive number let's provide me the number 5 standard number the factorial is 120 so here it took only 15 seconds me to run the application from creating till running the application it won't take that much so you can increase your productivity or efficiency let's again write this here you will see this button you can stop the generating code but intentionally I want to generate code once again hello world in Java it's very simple program so it is generating as and when you are asking the question and it is in real time what happens uh, generally I am a backend developer so I will improve my productivity with this chat GPT I will walk you through that how I can work quickly so I have already created one Spring Boot application and let's suppose someone wants me to write a REST controller and this is the basic application which is generated by Spring IO you can go through this spring initializer and you can generate that project directly from here and just I have downloaded the application based on this you can use any version and all after that I have downloaded that basic application and now I want to create a rest controller for a student let's start with the controller one then we can try to ask more question to the chat GPT let's so here I want write a student so here is my question write a student controller in spring boot so I want to modify instead of controller I will write rest controller so it is processing now so if you see here it is explaining everything writing the code from scratch So everything it is writing even student class it has written here it is explaining what till now it is completed okay so I will copy this code and I will paste directly here in my package and try to run this example so here if you see this is the student controller and I will segregate both of these classes because this is the different class so I will cut this class from here and I will paste here we have a student class in a student it is already taken two fields ID and name and created and it generated the constructor and also getter and setters now we have this student control class and in this control class we have cat mapping by which we can get the list of students and we can also get the student by id so here some dummy name he has provided so i will update the name aman and raj okay now let's run this example so i will try to run this example so this is the main method where we can run this application just run this application Okay, the application is up and running on port 8080. Let's try to hit this particular rest endpoint so that we can see is it working fine or not. Go there, just type localhost colon 8080 slash the URL. So if you see here, it is showing the list of students. And uh, one more endpoint 
we have created this is get by id so if you pass one then it will return aman if we pass two then it will return raj so here we need to pass the path this is our path variable okay if i want to get the second then just I need to pass two here. Also, if you want to add more element here, this is a simple list and they have created this constructor and initialize the list. If you want to add more element here also, we can add something like this. Okay. So here again, I need to run this application. So we have four records now. And if I want to access the fourth, then just I need to pass. So our endpoints are working fine. So it is not created by me. These endpoints are created by chat gpt so the question comes here will this chat gpt replace me what i'm doing here just copy paste and just running the application that's it so even this is also possible with some other technique by which we can generate the projects as well and we can add those files into that particular location and then it will work fine and here we have changed skins and all so that they can create builds of our application directly and they can they are able to deploy as well just we need to configure few things Jenkins and pipelines all those things by using chat GPT also we can create code in future this is chances for improving this chat GPT now the question is coming from Google as well will this chat GPT will replace the Google that is the question coming in few things also I want to explain you like uh, it uh, won't provide you images and the explanation like videos and images but um, as of now it is able to create content based on your uh, in text only it is the reply whatever we are getting it will provide you in the form of text not in the form of image and videos it has some limitations as well because won't reply on some unknown events okay i will search images rows here it has some limitation it won't provide you images let me search for my channel so i am sorry i am a text based ai language model and do not have capability to provide videos however you can easily find videos various activities on internet using video sharing platforms such as youtube so it is only text based ai language model but it is very helpful for us to uh, produce the code to use the code even now i want to write the test cases for it let's wait if it is not recognized then we can try other way so randomly i have used this question and now it is writing test cases for us test cases are very complex things in our projects we need to write test cases and we need to cover each and every line then only we can say we have written the test cases we can say we have added this functionality as per the requirement so it is writing for get all methods right now so it is checking the is ok status whether we are able to hit the url or not it is 200 in a status and now we are checking the content type is application slash json or not and it is checking whether it is array or not and then inside the array we are checking that it is at zero element okay we lost that network again i will try so here it has auto wired mock mbc and now it is writing test cases for get all student method it is expecting status code is okay then it is writing for find by id same thing it will write for it like status is okay and then whether the type is application slash json or not and the content is same or not so here if you see whatever i am saying it is checking whether those things status code and json value are same or not now you can copy this code and just you need to place here in the test folder now you can run this test code okay the application is already running let me stop the application and try to run this code once again it is giving error at this place okay it is searching for john but we have changed instead of john this is aman so let me correct this uh, otherwise it will give us an error let me comment this thing here it is aman 
second place this is raj similarly here it is aman okay now try to run this so if you see test cases passed in such cases so this is how we can use this chat gpt to improve our productivity we need not to worry about these codes otherwise we need to search on how to write tag overflow now chat gpt directly giving us the solutions just we need to copy paste and run the application that's it thank you so much for watching